Hey guys, Mr. Popsit here. Don't forget to check out Mr. Popsit Fishing. It's my new channel and it kind of helps the whole brand grow and it actually helps this channel too. So if you like what you're seeing, hit like and subscribe on Mr. Popsit and Mr. Popsit Fishing. Thanks for popping by. All right guys, Mr. Popsit here. This is a patient you've seen multiple times. It's kind of her take two because we saw her over a year ago, got her clear. Then she went out of the country for a while. She ran out of her medications and she flared again. So you can see she's doing great. Her forehead is literally almost clear. Most of the big ones are all gone, but she does have, and she's prone to some of these inflammatory ones on both sides. So we're gonna do a little squeeze. She's got a couple on the lips, some very tender areas today. So we're not gonna do a whole lot, but we're gonna get the ones that are bothering her. So we can start, this is kind of an inflammatory one right here. Get under that, couple squeezes, there comes the core. So you can see that core right in the middle of the pore, usually with a little hair on it. <laughs> right up against the wall here. Good, another one. This one's big and tender here, we're gonna go slow, sorry. Nice big core out of there. You can see, it's just kind of like a hard plug there. Once those come out, they feel a lot better instantly. That one was pretty tender for me to touch, but now you can see when that's out, I can actually squeeze pretty good. And it shouldn't feel much. Make sure the bottom of that pore is clear. Very good. Looking good. bit in there. You can see they really are drying up though with our retinoid treatment. Sorry, a little squeeze. Good. Big hair on that one too. Nice and clear. Very good. Let me see on this one. It's filling up with some fluid after we got that core out. Okay, a couple here, and she's got a big inflammatory one on the other side. It's right here. Don't know amount of strength. <laughs> Stick down. So with the amount of oil she produces, we can see we're getting her clear, but she really has a fairly quick refill. When I get to the fifth or sixth treatment on somebody and they're still refilling pretty quickly, we always consider Accutane, which is an oral retinoid. So something we're gonna consider in the next month here. Once we get her kind of clear and get the back and the chest, a lot of these pores emptied, then um, something like Accutane can keep it that way, dry everything up and sustain for years afterwards, which is nice. See if we can get anything out of that. That really popped out there. Good. Nothing left in there. And try just a little finger squeeze. This was the one that was giving us trouble earlier. Not much in there, actually. That is good. A couple good sized blackheads. Now we'll go to the other side. Okay, so this one is likely an inflammatory one here. Let's see if we can get a core. There we go. I think that's the one that kind of blew up on us last time or two times ago. Little core in there like that, you can see. Get that out and it goes down pretty quick. There's a little bit more behind it. That's just some purulence there. We'll get a, end up getting a band-aid there like that. Thanks, look at that, Johnny on the spot. Elf on the spot, I should say, huh? <laughs> nice, it's pretty good there. 
out the last bit. It's actually looking really good. Not too many on this side. Now she has a very tender one on the lip here and we're gonna see the light squeeze. If it's too much, you let me know. There we go. That's what was hurting you in there. You can see I can squeeze pretty hard now and she's okay. Nice core right there in the lip. You can see those. Good to get that out because that can be quite tender. She has two small ones on the other side we'll get. Actually, she can just turn this way. Two more on the lip here. Little squeeze. Good. See, these ones are more dry, just clogged pores. You don't get those out. You get that inflammatory pustule that we had, we just did there. So good to clear those pores out for her. There's a couple on the chin there we can get real quick. We're almost done. You guys walk out together, but you leave me to work by myself. Yeah, you first than us. Yeah, you can start your car from That's true. wherever you're sitting at. From a distance. I do, and I run to it and jump in. Do you? <laughs> no. I walk, but I get in. Very fast pace. But I get in. I walk at a very fast pace, and I get in there quick. <laughs> you should try putting her on a wig. <laughs> That'd be kind of You're making me laugh. <laughs> I'm on the job. Got it laugh. there. Very good. <laughs> that was so good. The camera's little... all shaky. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Everybody's laughing and moving. <laughs> Let me see here on the upper lip. We're doing okay. You did have a couple here before, but those dried up pretty nice, actually. Let me see the very edge here. I'm not sure if okay. Yeah, I'm just, just, I'm just, just getting a couple more. Perfect. Thank you. Uh -huh. She's doing so much better. You can see this PIH, post-inflammatory, a lot of these big ones we've gotten before. That's pretty much dried up. Just a little bruise in there, but that'll go away. A little pressure. Got Okay. Good. Got it. You can feel that pop. <laughs> that was a good pour. A lot in there. Almost. There we go. Okay. That's looking good. See on your cheek here, you're okay. You got these little ones. There's a big one there we could get. You doing okay? Mm -hmm. Good. I know those lips aren't fun, the lip ones. Actually, those aren't too bad. Right there on the cheek. It's a two for one, kind of coming out of two or three pores there. Very good. Right over the cheekbone there. Roll these. These are really drying up with the retinoid. They're hard to get out. That's a good sign now. Do a little finger squeeze here and get these. Very good. Okay. We got most of those inflammatory ones, the bigger ones that were kind of hurting you, and then a couple blackheads surrounding in that area. Some of them, they look like little shrimp. <laughs> but we're getting you close to where we want to be if we are going to start Accutane. So thanks for popping by, guys. That was her sixth or seventh. I have to count them. But once we're getting to that point, we're usually getting almost all the big and medium ones and just the little ones that retinoid can dry up. 
And going forward, we had the discussion if we want to do a systemic retinoid or not. So we did a, her back. Um, we cleared quite a few out and some big inflammatory ones. She has a couple in the chest we may do next time, and we'll check back in just a couple weeks, and then we're getting close to the end, which is good. So thanks again to her for sharing.